Bonjour. So I've just come back from the laundry where I've been sitting and I've been continuing to work on a new piece, finally incorporating some of these Art Nouveau elements from uh, places like Musée de Orsay with the photography that I took of Duchess de Berry and combining them into something very unique and very me. So that was great. I came to some conclusions yesterday that I will scrap trying to go to the Musée de Croix Branly um, and the Museum of Picasso. It's no wonder that my legs are hurting because yesterday I walked up what was one of the largest spiral staircases at any of the metro stations but it was it was beautifully decorated with murals so um, I just I just had to do it and get some footage of that. It's time for me to kick back and relax a little bit. Tomorrow's life drawing. I'm still going to go to East Bay's Dali because that's in Montemata but the great thing about Montemata is as I've discovered is it's full of these beautiful cafes and restaurants so I'll be going there and I'll be enjoying a good coffee and hopefully I'll find a place that has good vegetarian food. On the day that I go to life drawing I can do that and have a lunch before I go to life drawing. On the day that I go to the Dali Museum I can again do that, kick back and enjoy it. I can take my drawing pad, I don't have to worry about security guards and um, the anxiety of crowds. It's a very small museum so it'll be easy for me to quickly get through it and then get back to enjoying a, a little vacation. Again I can do the same thing, I can go out maybe have dinner in Montemata and maybe a few drinks, a few wines before I go to the Moulin Rouge. So yes, as I was sitting at the laundry, um, I, was ch I chatted to a young French gentleman. Um, he asked me, uh, do I do art for business or for pleasure? And I couldn't give him a clear answer. As of yet, do not consider myself even to be an artist. But that said, I've been looking through Art Nouveau quotes and um, Gustav Klimt said something very similar. This is the quote by Gustav Klimt. I can paint and draw. I believe this myself, and a few other people say that they believe this too. But I'm not certain to whether it's true. So I'm not the only artist in history who either does not consider himself an artist or does not consider himself to have much skill. Until then, I can say that I'm coming to the end of this particular part of this journey. But really, this is just the beginning of the Art Nouveau Manifesto.